Bought all the supplies for just about $25. I'll have all that information in the down bar below. And I'm just gonna mix it up and we'll see what happens. So originally I was thinking that I was just gonna grate it by hand with this, um, you know, like into a plastic bowl and show you that. But then I figured, I have this commercial grade food processor, let's use it. So I'm gonna actually do it in here. And uh, let me show you that. Okay, so now what you're supposed to do is just go ahead and unlock this. And I mean, who cares that that's soap? Because it's gonna go in the dishwasher anyway, so, so what? And look, it's cheese. So then you're supposed to add about a quarter bag of this into the, let's do it. As you can see, this is just super fine. What we're gonna do is take that mixture and just add it back to the bucket where we had mixed all the like borax and arm and hammer and all that other stuff. I'm just go ahead and repeat this process until all of this is gone. And I will show you the last step. This is so easy. I cannot believe I was paying for laundry. Okay guys, everything else is in the bucket except for this last ingredient, which is this. And the reason I waited until the end is because these are the little freshness boosters or you know, the little perfumey kind of smelling things. And if you have really sensitive skin or allergies or asthma or something like that, and you don't want that in there, completely optional this. So I'm gonna add it to mine. But if you do, this is where you stop and just go ahead and put it, mix it all together and put it in your storage container of choice. And then you're done. A little more than half of it in there, a minute. At this point, everything is mixed up. And then the last thing that you wanna do is just go ahead and kind of separate it down into the containers that you're gonna store it in. Now for me, I didn't want to do one like big five gallon container because I have to store mine above my washer and dryer and I don't want to have to, you know, reach up and pull down something that's so incredibly heavy. So I don't want to like hurt my shoulders or whatever. So I just bought a bunch of these little, you know, 95 cent trays from Walmart. Then I'm just going to put them in here and seal them and then that way as I need them, I'll just pull them down. Um, but the one that I'm going to have like on the actual dryer that I'm going to use is this little airtight container. That way I can just walk up, open it be done with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick and I'll show you what the final product looks like. And I just mixed up a smaller batch this time around just because I wanted to make sure that I like these particular scents because like I said you can change this or you could use you know you have pink zote soap or white zote soap you can use all kinds of different variables so I wanted to make a small one just to make sure well this isn't really small this will be probably many 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 months until I have to redo this so that probably doesn't look like a lot, but that whole thing, which God knows how long that will even last for. And then on top of that, I have this huge thing right here. That is cool. Just get a little two tablespoon coffee scoop, and that's what you, I really hope you guys enjoyed that. Please don't forget to click like and subscribe, and I will see you next Friday. Bye.